My name is Janelle Joseph. Due to a lack of wisdom in my financial life, I had problems with managing my finances. Even though I had a job and was making a good income, my financial life wasn't going anywhere because I was not managing my finances properly. I ended up in problems to the point where I used to go to money lenders to get money borrowed to pay my bills. Within one week of receiving my salary, my salary was totally over. And I always was in that cycle, money lender, pay bills, salary comes in, pay money lender, pay bills. And it was a total cycle. I wasn't able to do anything with my finances. I came to the Universal Church and due to the word of God about being faithful to God. And from that moment on, when I made that decision to put God first ahead of my finances, changes to start to happen. I began to see prosperity in my life. I began to see my salary even working better for me. I was able to use my money for investments. I even, somebody who used to borrow money before I even became a lender, I was able to give to people to the extent where true God being first in my life, everything that comes in my hand stays in my hand. Before it used to be like it reach and it just goes. But now it stays and I'm able to see my life go forward even more. The financial part of my life has excelled because of this and I have learned to be financially mature and this came from God. I was able to achieve um, a promotion in my job. I got my own car. I started two businesses and I'm able to help give people advice now on how to manage their finances. I came to each in a prayer on Mondays for my financial life to be blessed. And from since then, every single time I see my life going forward. I encourage you who maybe have the same problem like me. Yes, you may have money in your hand, but you are not seeing that money working for you. Come into the chain of prayer and learn how to manage your finance, finances, learn how to get the inspiration that comes from God when it comes to budgeting yourself and meeting your expenses every month. There is a
Хочу мною вас за мною. Dream from the river that flows before your throne. Take me deeper, deeper in love with you, Jesus. Hold me close. In your embrace, take me deeper, deeper than I've ever been before. I just want to love you more and more. How I long to be deeper. Sunrise to sunrise, I will seek your face. Drown by the spirit to the promise of your grace. My heart has found in you a hope that will abide. Forever satisfied. Take me deeper, deeper in love with you, Jesus. Hold me close in your embrace. Take me deeper. Love you more and more. How I long to be deeper in love. Take me deeper, deeper in love with you. Jesus, hold me close in your embrace. To love you more and more, how I long to be deeper in love. How I long to be deeper in love. My name is Vanessa Giddens. Before I came to the Universal Church, I used to have plenty of suicidal thoughts. Till the point I reached that I didn't want to kill myself. Until I heard a voice told me to take a blade and cut my hand. I did it. It was painful because I didn't have so much problem in my life, family problem. And I thought the only way out that I could have is to kill myself. I drank petrol. I always think of throwing myself in front of a bus. The worst moment of my life is when I lost everything in my life. I lost even relationship with my son father that he abandoned us and I did not know what to do. So I reached the point of gambling, partying, and stuff like that. And before I did not really want my son because I used to ask God, how am I going to take care of him? Until I heard a voice tell me to take abortion, but with that voice, I did not want to do it. I, I have two thoughts, one, two, and then not, until 
I came here to the Universal Church. I get counseling after I have my son. And from there, I start being the best mother that I could. I didn't know how to be a perfect mother for my son. I was young. I did not have the experience of taking care of my son. So I just didn't want to give up in life, everything. I got to know about the work of the Universal Church by a friend. Um, she, she did newly started to work where I used to work and every day she will be inviting me to come to church. But I used to always turn her down and say, I am so tired, I am not going to church because I used to ask myself, church on a week, especially on a Friday. I used to tell her I don't have time to come to church. Until one day I was going to see about some business and then I hear a voice told me, why do you, why, why do you go to the Universal Church and try it? So I went. And the first time I stepped my foot into the Universal Church, I feel a different. I felt different. And I just continue coming and coming until today I am set free of everything that I have. Today, I am no longer depressed. I am no longer have no suicidal thoughts. I can even provide for my son. I don't have the addiction anymore. I am set free of everything today. And I thank God that I found the Universal Church.